In this video, we're going to tell you which one of Colorado's 53 14ers is the easiest. Subscribe to Slow Boat Sailing, where we give you the secrets to crush your outdoor adventure. So there are 53 14ers in Colorado. It's overwhelming to choose which one to climb first. You don't want to fail on it. You don't want to walk too much. Uh, if you've got experience with hiking, you know that elevation gains are really hard. So which is the best one to do first if you are really lazy? And I have the answer for you. It's Mount Evans. All right, during the summertime, when the roads are open, recreation.gov, you can get a $15 permit to drive on the road. They give you a time to drive. We had to drive between two and four. The road is 14 miles up, almost all the way to the top of Mount Evans. That is up to 14,000 feet. And then you just have to do the last 130 or so 130 vertical feet on a nice trail with switchbacks on the day we were there there was snow so it made it somewhat challenging but it wasn't very far the rated distance they have for this round trip on all trails is 0.6 miles so i don't think you can beat that with about any other place say pike's peak which has a train to the top uh, and also a railroad. So maybe Pikes Peak and Mount Evans tie, uh, but Mount Evans is right by Denver, even closer than Pikes Peak. So that's why I give the crown to Mount, Mount Evans. Evans. So there's a road all the way up to the top. So if people tell you Bierstadt's the easiest, or if they tell you that Mount Sherman, because it only has 2,000 2, vertical feet of elevation gain, we only gained like 200 feet, 119 feet from the parking lot. And now we're 4,000, what is it, 160 or something feet on Mount Evans. All right, subscribe to Slow Boat Sailing. So even if your 14 or ambitions are a little higher than 0.34 miles and 200, 120 vertical feet, you still may want to drive up uh, Mount Evans as kind of like a climatization for another 14er that you think is more challenging. Uh, so if you have a, your eyes on Long's Peak or something like that, you can get the 14,000 feet acclimation in so that when you are at the summit after a very, very long walk and a very, very long elevation gain, then you have some acclimation. But really the hardest thing about Mount Evans is the drive up and down. So if you've got an iron willed driver then you'll be okay uh there are often no guardrails on the the road so the drive is the real adventure so of i've climbed several 14ers both in colorado and in california and i would say that mount evans was the scariest 14er i ever was on it was not because of the hike to the top but the drive up and down. But it's a beautiful drive. There's lots of animals. There's goats. Uh, there's uh, marmots everywhere. You're going to have a lot of fun. Just do it.